everybody, it's Dean DaCosta, the Search Authority. And well, today we are looking at a literally brand new tool, as in brand new as in a few minutes ago, an hour ago. It's called Welcome to People GPT. Um, you can find it at chat.jukebox.work projects. So first of all, there's free and paid. Now the free only allows you to do sample searches so you get an idea what you're doing. The paid one will let you find people's emails, download, and all that good stuff. And then the, exp the enterprise is for bigger stuff. So we're going to go in here and look at one. I've already ran a search, but I'm going to go ahead and run it again so you guys can see what's going on. Um, let's see here. So we got a bunch of different queries, sample queries, which is what we're allowed to do. The one I ran is right here, senior engineer, blah, 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 and duplicating the search. Here's the search down here, boom, 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 boom. In this case, it's senior engineer in California, four years experience, Wham, Luminar, 24 other companies. These are all people that do autonomous vehicle stuff. And we're gonna run the query. It's gonna run, it takes a second or two or three or four or five. And what it's doing is it's searching. Now, near as I can tell, it's really searching mainly LinkedIn. Uh, all these people seem to be linked in. Now you see the companies on the right, you see the people on the left, you can actually highlight them and go in and see more, see how it's linked in. And if we go back, you're gonna see almost every one of them linked in. So LinkedIn is definitely the common denominator. I don't see anybody that doesn't have a LinkedIn profile and all the people I've checked. So keep that in mind. Not to say they aren't other places, but they definitely linked in. From here, you can do email outreach and it will create the email for you, just like a, you know ChatGP does it. Um, you can find email just as so I'll even give you an example of an email it might it might do just so you can see it real quick. Give it a second. So this is it. We're looking for a talent to join our team. I'm Dean, Dean's workspace, blah blah blah. That's because I don't have a company name and all this blah 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 blah. Not an email I would send because it's too generic and too whatever. And there's several templates. That's template one. You got three templates, it appears, and this one I'm Dean, I'm doing research in the post-pandemic work balance. We're launching new product in space. Now this one's a little bit better. This one I like a little bit better. But anyway, you get the general idea. You can search within the list based on company name and stuff like that. You can do that. You can download the list right here. Of course, you have to have a paid version to do it. And it's actually kind of cool, um, but because I can only do um, basically the two or three um, searches that they dummy searches for like a better term, I can't really test it beyond that without paying and I'm not paying $49 a month to do it. Um, I do like it. Um, can you do all this without using this tool? Well, yeah, I mean, it's not hard to do a search, do an x-ray into LinkedIn to find people or be in LinkedIn and find people. It's not hard to scrape the information you find and then find contact information. And it's not hard to create an email. So yes, you can do it all without this tool. But like all tools, the idea is not that the tool does something you can't do, but it's designed to save you time. This will be able to do it quicker. Is it worth the 49 a month? Well, like I said, it's pretty much a LinkedIn tool um, at this point. I have no evidence to support saying it's anything but a LinkedIn tool. Like I said, everybody's LinkedIn. That said, it's cheaper than LinkedIn, that's for sure. So in that aspect, yeah, I mean, $49 a month is a heck of a lot better than, than $20,000 a year or whatever the heck a LinkedIn license is these days. I think it's $20,000. Um, it's just as fast, and you will be getting emails, so you won't be using in-mail, so that's good. Um, so for that aspect, it's pretty good. Um, however, if you're wanting to do things beyond just LinkedIn, which any good recruiter and sourcer should, because you can't, I don't care what anybody tells you, you're not gonna live on LinkedIn alone. There are a lot of hiring managers getting tired of it. It's hard to get link people to respond to your emails, and it's a pain in the butt. You, you know, and there are a lot of people that are not on LinkedIn. Let's get real, there are 480 million, even if you believe there's 680 million number, which is not true, there's still 680 million, great for them. There's 3.5 trillion on, on um, Facebook alone. 65 to 70% of the people on GitHub are not on LinkedIn. So no, not everybody's on LinkedIn. So there you go. That said, this is a good alternative to LinkedIn. You know, it's, um, it limits you to the results. Obviously you only get so many, so that could be a problem. You could end up running out. Um, even if you buy, spend the 49 a month, you're only going to get 200 credits a, a month to do much of anything. So that could be a problem. You're only going to get a hundred profiles per search. So that's a problem. 
and then with the enterprise version of course you know obviously you get what you you know you'll get what you pay for but you know you're going to pay for it it's still probably going to be cheaper than linkedin but that said you know, are. But again, here you go. A chat GPT tool designed specifically for people searching, specifically for recruiting. Yay, go team fight. Again, it's people GPT. You can find that at chat.jutespots.work. My name is Dean DeCosta, Search 30. May the source be with you.